Omaha City Council might send this local lounge to the state to request renewal of its liquor license. According to the resolution, at least 13 tavern reports have been filed with the City of Omaha concerning Throwback Arcade Lounge. City Attorney's Office says the reports, quote, detail a pattern of assaults and disturbances on the property. Tonight, KETV Newswatch 7's Sarah Feely talks with one man who says he was involved in one of those fights. Sarah. Julie, the State Liquor Commission, Commission reports five disturbances in the Throwback Arcade's history. The latest one is September 24th. The commission will be asked to determine if the bar should keep its license as that trouble continues, even this past weekend. I came to in the ambulance. They said I'd been knocked out a few times. Corey Arndt stepped off a party bus to celebrate his stepbrother's wedding Saturday. They were headed into Throwback Arcade Lounge, but Arndt says he was turned away. He had let everybody else in, but he had stopped me for being too drunk. That's the last thing he says he remembers until medics woke him up. An Omaha police report says five men got into an argument with Arndt before punching and kicking him, rendering him unconscious multiple times. When I asked my stepbrother if the bouncer had said anything, uh, he said that I, I may have been running my mouth a little bit, but that does not give the right to five or six guys to beat down on one guy. That assault outside led to a tavern report being filed against the bar off 14th and Howard. The city law department says it's one of 13 filed in the last year, and because of that, it wants the state to review the bar's liquor license, saying, quote, These reports detail a pattern of assaults and disturbances on or adjacent to the licensed premises, including multiple fight-related disturbances end quote. The law department also says, quote, additionally, there are allegations of the sale of alcohol to visibly intoxicated persons. In a statement, Throwback's owner says, quote, we're cooperating with the investigation and use our best efforts to maintain a safe premise. Arndt thinks the bar could use more security. They never served me one drink. You know, they didn't let me in because I was already drunk. So he, he was doing his job there. But you know, about the assaults happening outside, there might be a little bit more that can be done. If the city council approves the resolution tomorrow, Throwback will have to submit a long form application to the Liquor Control Commission. The commission will consider the bar's history and determine whether or not to renew its license. Julie, back to you. Okay, Sarah, keep us posted.